Hey guys, it's Billy Eichner out here playing one of my new favorite games, Nicolas Cage character or rapper. We have two great contestants. What is your name, miss? Mariah. Mariah? Like Mariah Carey? Just like that. Oh, wow. Wow. She had twins. Me too. You do? Yeah. Really? Yeah. You're lying. Oh. You're lying to me. You're lying! Yes. <sighs> what is your name, sir? My name is Nick. Nick, and, and how do you know this idiot? Oh, uh, that's my fiance. Oh, I'm so sorry. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, here we go. We're gonna play Nicolas Cage character or rapper. I'm gonna give you a name, and you have to buzz in and tell me whether it's the name of a Nicolas Cage character or a rapper. If it's a Nicolas Cage character, you say? Nicolas Cage. Ca Nick Cage! No, Nick Cage! Well, you, you were calling him Nicolas Cage. Well, I'm shortening it for the game! All right. Jesus, dances with wolves over here. And if it's a rapper, you say? Rapper. Yes, correct. So you say Nick Cage or rapper. If you get the question right, you get a point. If you get it wrong, the other person gets the point. The one with the most points at the end of the game wins a big prize. You understand, Mariah? Yes. You understand, Nick Cannon? Yes. Okay, here we go. And away we go. Johnny Blaze. Mariah. Nick Cage. Yes, correct. Mariah gets the point. Gucci Mane. Rapper, you, were, you did not buzz, you idiots! Well, I buzzed! Shut up! Mariah gets the point. Lupe Fiasco. Rapper. What? Rapper! <laughs> yes, correct, he gets the point. Memphis Reigns. Mariah. Nick Cage. Yes, correct, Mariah gets the point. Tyga. Rapper. Rapper. Get out of here. Top. Mariah gets the point. Get back in! Uh, Speckles! Speckles! Rapper? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, shoot, <laughs> shut up! Nick Cage, give me this buzzer! Let's go! Let's go, Cool Keith! Rapper! Yes, correct! Benjamin Franklin Gates! Go! Nick Cage! Yes, correct! One more Yellow Wolf! Yes! Rapper! Yes, correct! Who wins? Mariah! Mariah wins! Mariah wins! Nick Cage, a rapper! Congratulations! Thank you! Okay, great. Thanks for playing, guys. Bye! <laughs> Hey guys, it's Billy Eichner, and this is Funny or Die's Billy on the Street, a new music and pop culture trivia game show. But before we get to our big three round game, let's take a look and see what happened when I hit the streets to play a game I like to call for a dollar. Here we go. Sir, for a dollar, true or false, the TV show Dawson's Creek originally aired on BET. True or false? True. No, Dawson's Creek is the whitest show of all time. I'm black. I know. Do you watch La Deshonda's Creek? No. Oh, you would love that. Okay, thank you very much. Miss, miss, seen any good movies lately? The Muppets. Oh, I love that. I finally saw it. How good was Jason Segel in that? Very good. Yes. Amy Adams is great, too. My name is Amy. What? My name is Amy. Wow. Miss, big year for Kristen Wiig, huh? Who is it? Kristen Wiig from Bridesmaids. Oh, I never saw it. What? Graham. It's a movie. I don't watch television. It's a movie. It's a movie, Bridesmaids. Bridesmaids was a huge movie where Melissa McCarthy stole every scene. John Hamm had a cameo. Oh, John Hamm, I know. Oh, of course. Everyone loves John Hamm. John Hamm this and John Hamm that. What about Melissa McCarthy? Never heard of her. You didn't, I don't, you don't watch Mike and Molly? Never. She won the Emmy for Mike and Molly. Like the Meryl Streep of fat people. Don't you know that television is boring? Television is the greatest thing that's ever happened to me. Oh, well, then I feel sorry for you. I feel sorry for you. You <laughs> should have more in your life. I don't, and I don't care. I'm very happy. I'm very satisfied. Good. I'm glad. What do you do that's so special? Lots of things. Like what? Like Name one. Name one. Not television. It's that sitting in front of a box that just is yapping at you. I love sitting in front of a box. Oh, you're very judgmental. <laughs> you really are. And what are you doing this for? This is for a television show, which you're never going to see, unfortunately. Bro, what's the name of the television show? You've just gotten... Oh, is this the noon? Hey. Hello. You see, anything can happen <laughs> on television. But nothing good. Just boring things. You're ridiculous. Just boring things. What do you do? Go out and see some concerts. And I go don't to... want to see a concert. Oh, well. I don't want to see a concert. Well, then you have then you're not cultured. I am very cultured. I watch Mike and Molly. I have it on my DVR. I have seven episodes saved. That's not culture. Did you go to Lincoln Center? I don't want to go to Lincoln Center. <laughs> you know why? Because extremely old people go there. That's why. Oh, no. I like to be around young people who are on Facebook and YouTube. Go on trips and see the world. Go 
on trips via the television. Oh, no. Yes, I am on a journey with Mike and Molly's character. They're trying to lose weight. Miss, for a dollar, who's better, Julia Roberts or Sandra Bullock? I'm sorry, what? Who's better for a dollar, Julia Roberts or Sandra Bullock? Sandra Bullock. No, it's Julia. Sorry. Who do you think Sandra's better? Julia's time has come and gone, hasn't it? Brunette. Julia's a brunette. Uh, not really. What do you think she is? She is. She's a pretty woman. She had red hair, but that was fake. Uh, I don't know. No, I think... What? Uh, Sandra Bullock. Why, though? I don't know. She just appeals to me more. What, what, what's your favorite Sandra Bullock movie? The one she was in, uh, Green Card. What? Green Card. That was Andy McDowell, you bitch. Hey guys, it's Billy. I'm out here now in front of Occupy Wall Street, where people have come from all over the city, all over the country, all over the world to call for bank regulation and economic reform. I'm gonna go talk to some of these folks right now. Here we go. Have you seen The Iron Lady with Meryl Streep? I haven't seen that. You should. I should? Yeah, it's excellent. I will. Yeah, she's, a, she's a terrific actress. I love Meryl Streep. Yeah, who, who else do you like? Who else do I like as an actress? Let's see. I kind of like... Um, Not Kate Hudson. No, not really. Although, no. she can be funny at times. No, she cannot. Like, one time she was funny by accident. By accident. I think I like Leonardo DiCaprio, actually. What was that? I like Leonardo DiCaprio, actually. He's very good. Sorry, these people are coming by. They're protesting police brutality. Hold on. Listen, listen. Here we go. I'm going to play a game right now. You can win money right now. Round one, question one. Oh, my God. In Buffy the Vampire Slayer, what happened when Buffy staked a vampire? A, it vomited blood. B, it was like, ow. C, it exploded into dust. D, it joined the cast of Bones. Oh, crap. <laughs> it exploded into dust. Correct, yes, correct, yes, yes. Question two here at Occupy Wall Street. Here we go. Which of the following was brought on to co-host the talk with Sarah Gilbert and Julie Chen? Do you like Julie Chen? I don't know. She hosts Big Brother. Oh, okay. Yeah, she's Les Moonves' wife from CBS. I'm not such a TV watcher, but let's... You're doing great. <laughs> let's do it. Occupy Wall Street. Here we go. Which of the following was brought on to co-host the talk? A, Chris Brown. B, Chris Allen. C, Chris Angel. D, Chris Jenner. Chris Jenner. Is that the answer? Stop yes. Correct. Yes, yes, yes. You're on to question two. Yes, here we go. Here we go. What are you doing here, sir? He's just my friend. He's... We're actually walking this way. Oh, and then... that's your friend? Yes. Okay, jump in here. What's your name? Julio. Julio, and why are you at Occupy Wall Street today? Well, because I uh, live in the oldest colony in the Americas, and it's Puerto Rico, 504 years, 116 with the United States. Isn't Ricky Martin Puerto Rican? You're correct. Okay, great. Here we go. Question two. Kristen Stewart is playing the main character in the new adaptation of which fairy tale? A, Little Red Riding Hood. B, Goldilocks and the Three Bears. C, Snow White. D, Goldilocks and the Three Bears. Two, Sisters Still Got It. Little Red Riding Hood. Little Red Riding Hood's your answer? Yeah. Well, that's incorrect. It's Snow White. <laughs> Okay. Oh, Kristen Stewart can't play Little Red Riding Hood. Not Little Red Riding Hood, but in Little Red Riding Hood. No, no, it's not. You got one wrong, but you're still in the game. You're still in the game. Okay, round two, question one. Here we go, occupying Wall Street. According to Radar Online, photos of Shaq with his new girlfriend are shocking because A, she is not made out of poker chips. B, she is not made out of tortilla chips. C, she is much shorter than he is. D, she is not a black woman, and all black men prefer to date black women exclusively. <laughs> She's not a black woman. Is that your answer? Yeah. Sure. Yeah. Julio, what do you think? I think is she's too short for him. Oh, Julio's saying it's because she's too short. White was short too, though. Shantae. Or Figure it out. We're occupying Wall Street. I don't know. I would say because she's not black. She's not black. Yeah. You're going against Julio. I love Julio, but I think it's because she's not black. Okay, this is for the game. You are incorrect. No, Julio was right. She's much shorter than he is. Oh, no longer allowed to occupy Wall Street. Oh, no, we're always occupying. I don't have, I don't have a plane ticket to go back to my home. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, this is home? Home right it's now. Home. Oh, you sleep here? Yes. Oh, this is home. Well, that's fun. Well, just remember to see the Iron Lady with Meryl Streep. Okay. Okay, bye, guys. Have fun occupying Wall Street. Just snap my foot? No!
Hey guys, it's Billy out here in Chinatown in New York City, ready to play my new favorite game, Scientologist or British person. I'm going to tell this person the name, and this person has to tell me whether it's the name of a Scientologist or a famous British person. What's your name, sir? Romulo. Romulo, what do you do in New York City? Uh, waiter. Oh, waiter. What restaurant do you work in? La Nona. La Nona. What do they serve there? Uh, Italian food. Okay, great. Hello. Hello. Okay, we're going to play Scientologist or British person. Uh, Jesus is soon coming back. Huh? Jesus is soon coming back. Jesus is soon coming back? Yes. That's amazing. Oh, uh, you didn't know that? I didn't know. No one told me. Oh, well, now, now you know that. Now I know. I'm happy to know that. And you have to be ready. I am. I'm ready. We're going to play Scientologist or British person until Jesus gets here. But you, you have to put yourself in play. Okay, thank you. Okay, Romulo, ready to play Scientologist or British person? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Okay, here we go. Do you want to come in here, miss? Come in here. Okay, now she doesn't want to play. Okay, Jesus, Jesus went that way, I guess. On break time. Okay, <laughs> here we go. Scientologist or British person? If you think they're a Scientologist, you say Scientologist. If you think they're a British person, you say British person. If you get seven right in 30 seconds, you win a big prize. You ready to play? Yeah. Here we go. Put a 30 seconds on the clock, please. Scientologist or British person? And away we Go, Jenna Elfman. Scientology. Yes, correct. Mini Driver. British person. Yes, correct. James Blunt. British person. Yes, correct. Piers Morgan. British person. Yes, correct. G Giovanni Rabisi. Uh, Scientology. Yes, correct. Lisa Marie Presley. Uh, British person. No, Scientologist. Juliet Lewis. Uh, British person. No, Scientologist. Jason Lee. British person. No, Scientologist. Ten seconds. Kelly Preston. Uh, British person. No, Scientologist. Sienna Miller. Uh... British person. Yes, correct. Did he get it? Yeah. No, Romolo, I'm sorry. So close. Okay, no problem. But thanks for playing. Unfortunately, you lost, so you know what that means. What that means? You have to get covered with a sheet. Oh, I'm sorry, Romolo. Thanks for playing, though. Okay. Okay, uh, good luck at the restaurant. Uh, thanks, thanks, thanks. Okay, bye, Romolo. <laughs> sir, sir, want to play the new Funny or Die game show? You can win real money right now. It's real fast. What's your name? Uh, I'm Cody. Cody? Okay, I'm Billy. Nice to meet you, Cody. Nice to meet you. Where are you off to today? Uh, I'm going to Home Depot. Oh, what are you going to buy there? Uh, screws. <laughs> oh, I bet you are. Good one. Okay, great. Thanks. Okay, here we go, Cody. Like, Kathy Lee Gifford's son is named Cody. I don't spell it the same way, though. Wow, let's talk about that for an hour. Okay. Okay, here we go. Round one, question one. If you get two questions wrong, you're out. If you need help answering a question, you can beg a stranger, have me act out the answer in charades, or call a woman. You ready to play? Sure, okay. Okay, here we go, Cody Lee Gifford. Round one, question one. After dumping Jesse James, Sandra Bullock did the following. A, adopted a black baby boy. B, began principal photography on Hope Floats 2, Float Harder. Steve started dating Hillary Swank. D, continued to pretend not to notice swastikas. A. A, adopted a black baby boy. Yeah. Correct, Cody, yes. Question two, here we go. What is Lady Gaga's real name? A, Margaret Cho. B, Puss in Boots. C, Dopey D, Sneezy E, Stephanie Germanata. Uh, E. East Stephanie Germanata. Right. Correct, Cody. Okay, here we go. Question three. If you get this right, we move on to the second round for double the money. Question three. Joel McHale, host of The Soup, is no longer allowed to make fun of which reality stars? A, hoarders. B, fat people. C, Jews. D, the Kardashians. Uh... Think about it. A? A, hoarders? Yeah. Oh, I'm sorry, Cody. No, he's on E and so are the Kardashians. The answer is D, the Kardashians. But you're still in the game. Okay. If you get one more wrong, you're out. We're moving on to round two. You won 25 bucks. All right, sweet. Here we go. Ready for round two? Yeah, definitely. What do you do for work? Um, unemployed at the moment. Wow. Damn Obama, right? Yeah, he did it. He did everything. He did everything. So. Yeah, that's right. And little Sasha and Malia running around like, 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 no, like they haven't got a care in the world. It's not fair. Unbelievable. <sighs> I voted for Laura Linney. If everyone had done that, we would have been in good shape. Here we go, round two, question one. What is the full title of the movie popularly known as High School Musical 3? A, High School Musical 3, Senior Year. B, High School Musical 3, Graduation Time. C, High School Musical 3, No More Hymen. D, High School Musical 3, Sabrina's Pregnant. A. A, High School Musical 3, Senior Year, are you sure? Yes. Correct, Cody! Yes. yes, you're still in the game! <laughs> Question two, here we go. Rihanna recently wore a bathing suit that pictured which dead musician? A, Kelly Rowland. B, Lisa Left Eye Lopez. C, Mark Anthony, not actually dead, but freakishly thin for a man. D, Bob Marley. E, Amy Winehouse. 
Uh, uh, act out in charades. Okay, here we go. We're gonna act out in charades. Put 60 seconds on the clock, please. Here we go. Any idea? Amy Winehouse. Huh? Amy Winehouse. That's not Amy Winehouse, that's Bob Marley! <laughs> not the way, I know, he does. Excuse me, he does? He play the... That's uh, terrible, no. What? No, what would you do for Bob Marley? Uh, probably like stamp my foot or like... No, I don't have to stamp my Stare? foot! No! That's what he did! I don't, I don't no, I shot the shot, I know Bob Marley, <laughs> I have the greatest hit. Really this was, was his was him, you know, doing his hair in the morning. Uh, I get that part then. You're ridiculous. But well, you're wrong. You're wrong, and I'm sorry. The game's over. All right. Well, thanks. We could have got this. This is easy to get. No, uh, he has right. dreads. I know he is. Get out of here. What? That's what. Hey guys, it's Billy. You know, I talk to so many people on the street each week, I don't always have time to show you every game. So here are some moments you may have missed. Take a look. In her breakout single, I'm Like a Bird, Nelly Furtado says she's like a bird because A, she's gonna fly away, B, she's gonna take a crap on your shoulder, C, she's gonna eat crumbs on the sidewalk, D, she's gonna befriend an old lady. My answer is I like to fly away, fly away, fly away. Okay, so which, uh, fly away, uh, A. Oh. Correct, Rose, yes! What? Yes, what? Which of the following is an actual line from 50 Cent's hit song, Into Club? A, your ass is like a bucket of meat. B, I'm into having sex, I am into making love. C, I only date women who work at Boston Market. Or D, you're like the third fat person I've had sex with. I have no idea. Well, take a guess, or I can beg a stranger, I can call my friend Diane. D. What? D. D, you're like the third fat person I've had sex with? I guess so, yeah. No, that's wrong. I'm sorry. Okay. What's your name again? Joel. Oh, boy, you're an idiot. OK, here we go. You can still beg a stranger. I can call a woman. Do you like women? <laughs> They're OK. Are you lesbian? No. OK. <laughs> is it the hair? Yes, it is, actually. Hey, I like Paul Abdul. Okay. Don't assume things about me. You can't hate Paul Abdul. She's like a chihuahua whose hind legs don't work, so they've been replaced with wheels. How many wounded and or diseased pets do you think Sarah McLaughlin owns? A, seven, B, 24, C, 40, D, hundreds. Think about it. I'm going to go with the extreme and just say hundreds, because that seems like an absurd question. Hundreds? Why is that absurd? I don't know. I guess... Have you ever seen her public service announcement where she's crying and her terrible song is playing in the background? You know, the cats in that video are sick because of her music. Which one of these celebrities is craziest? A, Lady Gaga, B, Jim Carrey, C, Susan Sarandon, D, George Lopez. Think about it. I'm going to have to go with Gaga on that one. Lady Gaga? Oh, I'm sorry, Ashley, that's wrong. No, the craziest celebrity is Jim Carrey. Jim Carrey. I think Gaga's not crazy. She wants you to think she's crazy. I think she's insane. Oh, please, my niece is crazier than Lady Gaga. She puts tinfoil on her head and calls herself Dr. Batman. <laughs> Okay. You know who's crazy? My aunt who keeps my niece in the basement. That's crazy. Okay. Who is rumored to be playing Amy Winehouse in an upcoming biopic? A, Emma Stone, B, Lady Gaga, C, Leah Michelle, D, Andy Richter. Hey, do I get another shout out? Yeah, you can get a shout Miss, I mean, miss, no, miss, no, she no, needs... No, 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 I don't want her. Don't want Why don't you want her? Yeah. Okay, all right, Rose is pulling me. Let's go. Let's go. Who do you want? Let's go. Let's go. Let's Come go. here, miss, 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 miss. I want miss. you. She needs okay. help answering a question. Where are you from? Switzerland. Oh, she don't know. Okay, all right. Miss, Miss, Miss David needs help answering a question for money. Please, please, it's for money. Oh, sir, please, please, Miss David, please, 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 please. Oh my God, my pants are falling. Lauren, Lauren, my pants are falling. Lauren, my pants are falling. A, Emma Stone, B, Lady Gaga, C, Leah Michelle, D, Andy Richter. I need an answer. Lady Gaga. Rose. You're correct! Ah! Yes, you're correct! Ah! Yes, you're right. Rose, you're still in the game. Ah! Rose, Rose, you're still in the game. Ah, you're still in the game. Ah, 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 ah. Okay. Like you lost the game, but you won the toast. The toast, you had fun. Okay. What's your name? I'm Billy. What's your name? Steve. Well, Finnegan, really. I think we're that. Steve Finnegan. Damn. Damn. <laughs> Damn toast. Damn toast. We're back. Billy on the street. It's okay. Bring out our surprise celebrity guest. Oh, it's Blink-182's Mark Hoppin! Hi! Hey! 
Yeah, hop it, Elmo, Elmo, hop it. Hello, Mr. Elmo. Good to meet you, sir. Are you a Blink-182 fan? Yeah, I, yeah, yeah, I am, yeah. I can see the lie in your eyes. I can no, see no, it in your no, eyes. No, 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 no it's like, cool. I mean, the first album's great. Oh, good. Okay, there oh, you go. Boy. Okay, cool. That's cool. Okay, here we go. Here's the question, Hoppus. Which of these people is still alive? A, sax icon Clarence Clemens. B, Mrs. Garrett from the Facts of Life, Charlotte Ray. C, former first lady Betty Ford. D, Jamie Foxx's blind gravy train, Ray Charles. Uh, B. What do you say, Elmo? Do you accept his answer? I'll take it. Correct! Yes, yes, Hoppus got it! Like the second album now, huh, bitch? Oh, yeah, thanks, Hoppus. Bye, Hoppus. Okay, you're still in the game, ass. Mark Hoppus comes out. You say you like Blink 182. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Say I lied there. Here we go. Unbelievable. Dream. He's making dreams.